Hello, Father Rich Pagano here for the 14th Sunday in Ordinary Time. And the first reading that we have this upcoming Sunday is from Zechariah chapter 9. And we hear that Christ is related to this king that's coming to save us. So shout with great joy and jubilee, O daughter Jerusalem, because Christ, this Savior, is coming meekly, riding humbly on the back of an ass, on a colt, the foal of an ass. This is like a, a beast of burden, but it's also a beast of humility, in a sense. So what will God banish then? If this is how our Savior, the King of Kings, is going to come to us, he's going to banish the chariot from Ephraim, the horse from Jerusalem, the warrior's bow he shall banish, and he shall proclaim peace to all of the nations. So Christ, the Son of God, the great victor over sin and death, he comes peacefully. He does so and takes up dominion not with the sword, not with any of these dynamics that are present in the scripture that relate to warfare, like chariot, like horse, like bow. He breaks all of these things, and he does so by his own death, uniting us by his blood and his sacrifice. He establishes peace through the hearts of his believers and followers. This great passage from Zechariah concludes, his dominion shall be from sea to sea and from the river to the ends of the earth. This dominion is before us in and around all of us. Let us live under his dominion and live peacefully in this world that may be torn by strife, bloodshed, and warfare. But in our hearts, we live a kingdom that knows no such sin, but knows a savior who is coming to us humbly this weekend. Hey guys, thanks again for watching. And you know, as summer's going on, you've got a lot of leisure time. You've got a ton of extra space to put God into it. So why don't you swing by the chapel and enter into a little period of adoration today. God bless.